Welcome to the homework for lesson 23. This is module 6 of first grade. Get your name on here first. And we're just adding pennies to show the written amount. So what we have to do here is look at this. This has to be 15 cents, whatever these coins add up to. Well, we have a dime, right? And a dime is 10. So we need 15. We need 5 more cents. So that the only way to get that is we have to add pennies. It says we have to add pennies. We could draw a nickel, but it says pennies. So that's 11, 12, 13, 14. That's 14, <laughs> 15, uh, 28 cents. So the quarter is 25. So we need 26, 27, 28, three more pennies. 22 cents. Well, let's see. This is this dime is 10 and this nickel is 5. So 10 and 5, that's 15. So we need 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And here we need a total of 32 cents. So we have a 10 here and a 10 there, and this is a 5. So two 10s and a 5. That's 10, 20, 25. So 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. And it says write the value of each group of coins. So here we have dimes. Those are tens. And pennies, it says right here, they're one cent each. So that's 10, 20, 21, 22. It's 22 cents. Now here we have a nickel for five. And it looks like we have one, two, three, four, five. Yes, we do. We have a 10 frame of pennies. So that's 10 cents, that whole thing right there. So five and 10, 15 cents. This quarter is 25 cents. And you can write it right on the coin. I mean, I'm using a different color so you can kind of see it, but you could, it might be better to write them above here if you think of it. So that's 25, 26, 27, 27 cents. And then here, these pennies, I see one, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm going to just call that six cents. And this is a quarter here. That's 25 cents. So 25 plus six. And you could count this up if you, if you want to. If you know 25 plus six, you can do that in your head. Go ahead. But otherwise, you can just count up 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 31 cents. And finally here, we have a bunch of pennies and two dimes. So this dime is 10, this dime is 10, and then we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So this is a 10, that's a 10 group of pennies. That's another 10. And then here we have two more. So we have what do we have here? We have 10, 20, 30, and 2 for 32. 